Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying Don't Forget Cake. Uh, I have the caramel, the chocolate peanut butter. Red velvet and carrot cake. These were $3.99 each at Jungle Gems International Market. And when I saw them, uh, I had to have them. I, you know, when it, it's cake, it was in uh, the refrigerated section, like um, like where the like pudding, like refrigerated pudding. That's where these were. So we're gonna go ahead and open these. They all come sealed. So just to make it. And the it, seal comes off the whole container. So. Yeah, yeah. It's it, they they did a very good job wrapping the jar. I yeah. mean, they're making sure that. Uh, Seems you're like safe. that'd be easier to do anyway. Wrap the whole thing up. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so what we are going to do with these, you have to see the scale here. Uh, it would be these. We have to ruin it. Yeah, we have to ruin everything. Uh, these are personal layer cakes. And when they say personal layer cakes, I take that as a personal challenge to eat the whole thing in one sitting. That, you know, uh, that's just honesty there. Uh, so what we're going to do is there's actually supposed to be three and a half servings in here. So even though it's personal, you're supposed to eat it at different for different times, not the same time. Uh, so we're going to weigh it. This is caramel vanilla cake and cream cheese frosting and caramel uh, you enjoy these refrigerated or frozen store in the fridge for 60 days 80 grams is 280 calories frozen. and i can't imagine it frozen no like ice cream uh, www.don'tforgetcake.com these are made in washington dc hmm. Okay. Ooh. Looks cool. Okay. So we are trying to get going off. 80 grams. Why does it keep going off? I don't know. It's annoying. Do you need to, do you want to use it? No, you can scoop it out. Just because we haven't eaten off this yet, so. Yeah, when are we getting? I think your battery's going My battery. Do you have an extra battery? I don't know if I have an extra battery or not. It is low. We'll be right back. We have replaced the battery. <laughs> Okay, we're going for 80. You know, it's there. Oh, there you go. It's almost half. Is that right? 80 grams. Don't go too big. That's way too big. That's way too big. Okay. There you go. No. No, I think I could have gotten it. That's 76. That's close enough. Hey, whatever. It's all right. It's that's okay. pretty much, that's really like almost half the container. <laughs> Literally, that's half the container. Isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know you have. <laughs> I'm making a mess over here. I don't know how you're supposed to get three and a half servings of that. No, because really, it's, all, it's really half. You really, really taste the cream cheese, mm -hmm. don't you? The cream cheese is what you taste the most of. That is the whole top layer is cream cheese. The um, the cake is like the crumbled up cake. It would be easier to eat, of course we're weighing it. It'd be easier to eat out of the container because you can just scoop yes. in and get everything. No one is stopping. You wouldn't stop eating that though. No, I'd eat the whole thing. That is so delicious. The caramel is incredibly sweet. It's really good. But uh, the, the cake is moist without being wet. Uh, but the, the cream cheese is the star of the show. I don't know. Are they all different weights? Mm -hmm. No, it's all 80. It's all based on 80 grams. It's just different. We don't need to wait. It's just different calories. But you saw, well, this one's 82. It, that's about how much we're uh, anyway. So, so you saw how much was on that plate. That's how much you're going to get. So do you want to eat the rest of them on a plate? Or do no, you want to eat just, them out of the jar? Do you want to scoop them out just so people can see them? Or? Uh, no, because honestly, I'll take my picture at the end out, out of the jar. Of the, yeah, so just. Because yeah. I think it, it looks better out of the jar, <laughs> like it's supposed to, than <laughs> what I did with it. Yeah, I, I just made a mess yeah. with it. This, uh, but that is incredible. It is very, very good. Definitely get that again, again. But nobody is stopping with. Uh, I definitely wouldn't. Well, yeah. some people might, but I wouldn't. 
this is chocolate peanut butter, cream cheese frosting, peanut butter, chocolate, cake, and caramel. It is 290 calories for the same same size. Got a swirl of peanut butter on top. And uh, so, why don't you go first? She always likes me to take the first bite. I do. I feel like I can get more of what I want. If I scoop all the way to the bottom. Man. You do. You do. Well, you get a huge bite too. Huge bite. I do get a huge bite. And now see, that one is a little more dense and dry. I literally get a bite from top to bottom. That's why. Mm -hmm. I still primarily get the oh. cream cheese, but I also get a little bit of the peanut butter flavor too. Mm -hmm. You know what's funny is the chocolate. I taste chocolate, but that's not the primary flavor, even though it's full of chocolate. No, I think for me it's peanut butter. Peanut I got a and lot. Cream of, cheese. Yeah. Who knew peanut butter and cream cheese? That's like a peanut butter cheesecake. That's delicious. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that is absolutely delicious. And you really do get a nice, sweet peanut butter. The cake in this one is a little drier than in the first very one. Very dense. But it still is wonderful. Yep, yeah, it's very good. You're flavor. still going to open that and eat it all. Uh, you are. Uh, well, just like a Ben & Jerry's. Um, we've never been able to open a Ben & Jerry's. No, and Ashley we, does, but we don't. Ashley does do that. It makes you sick. Those people make you sick. They can eat a, take a bite and put it back in the freezer. We're, we're not those people. I'm not. Um, this is 290 calories uh, for the red velvet. Red velvet cake and vanilla flavored cream cheese frosting. And once you get that plastic off, they're real easy to open. Oh, yeah. It's not like you have to manhandle it or anything. It comes off really easy. I like that. You don't need the You don't man. have to have the man to open the jar. Ooh, it's a pretty red, isn't it? And you know, did you notice that down in there, there's another layer of cream cheese? I noticed that with the peanut mm -hmm. butter. The peanut butter in the cake, there were like spots of cream cheese in the cake part. See, down in there, there's like a whole other yeah. layer. Yeah. A wide, okay. You can see it in there too. The middle layer was a little mm. softer. It's really good. It tastes like red velvet. Yes. And red velvet to me wouldn't be red velvet with that cream cheese frosting. You have to have cream cheese frosting. I have to get, get it out of my mustache and beard. <laughs> that. That's very good. If you've ever had red velvet, it's classic red velvet. There's mm -hmm. no denying what it is. If you were blindfolded, you would say, that is red velvet. Mm -hmm. Has that typical red velvet flavor. It's wonderful. This is carrot cake, carrot cake, and vanilla flavored cream cheese frosting. It is 300 mm -hmm. calories. I like how these are, it's like a cake they've crumbled up in there. Mm -hmm. But it's almost like they could have taken them and put them in a, like a, a plate almost. And and had just a cake sitting on a on a plate, you know, or packaging. Or yeah, but this is easier to, to transport. Yeah, this no, is I'm just easier saying, on everybody. The textures and stuff. I was expecting something much softer. Oh. And thinner and runnier. Right. Uh, it's not like a, this is a firm, like truly a cake. Well, the softest one. Now I haven't eaten this one yet, but the softest one so far has been that first one. Mm. Mm. That one's kind of in between the peanut butter and the red velvet. Gosh, I love the pieces of carrot. The carrot. It's not quite as firm as the caramel peanut butter or the peanut butter one. Is it called? Chocolate peanut butter. It's not quite as firm as that one because that one's very, very dense. But it's not quite as soft as the red velvet. So it's, it's kind of in between there. It's good. These, honestly, have exceeded my expectations. It's very carroty though. Oh, but it's perfect. It is. That's, I mean, that's like whole, this is homemade carrot cake. It this is. isn't the kind of really just, uh, If you like the kind of carrot cake that has the flavor of carrot and less spice, that is what you're looking for. Mm -hmm. If you want one with less carrot, which me, I want less carrot and more of the spice 
flavor, then you won't like that because I don't really care for that one because it's just so, it's carrot. To me, this is homemade carrot cake. This is the kind when it you, is. you have your mama's recipe at home, you're making it at home. It's this is crunchy, mama's carrot, carrot cake. Though. Yeah, that is, it's, it's perfect for me. That is what I expect when I have a piece of carrot cake. Yeah. Not the kind that you get at the store that's mainly like a spice cake and yeah. you're like, where's the carrots in the carrot cake? I don't really like carrots though. <laughs> Kevin is not a carrot person. No. I am. So for me, they did a good job yeah. on that. Um, these are all. They're all really, really good. Terrific. They really, really are. Um, I have never seen these before. Uh, I'm wondering, since they're made in Washington, D.C., if this is like a Northeastern product. So if you're all over anywhere else in the United States, please tell us, have you ever seen these? Uh, in your uh, the refrigerated section of your grocery store because they really are delicious and do they have more flavors do they have um, lemon or key lime or, or other flavors so these were the only four that Jungle Gems had yeah. and they're very very good so I can only imagine the other ones being very good too you only have four dollars which one of them mm -hmm. you can only choose you know one what? I really really liked the first one we tried I did too, the caramel, that's mine. Because you know what too? It was still the moistest. The other ones, they weren't not bad, but they were drier than that initial, that first right. cake. This was the moistest one that we had, and it's just incredible. It's very good. So I'm choosing that, that one. one. And then if I had to pick a second one, it would probably be the red velvet. Second one for me is probably gonna be I like the peanut butter, but peanut I'm gonna butter say was just a little too dense. I'm gonna say the carrot cake because really? I, I like the carrot cake. Yeah. I, I probably wouldn't get the carrot cake all the time because that's one of those specialty flavors. So the two that I would probably get all the time would be the chocolate peanut butter and the the caramel, the caramel. because those are everyday things that I'm never. I'm, let's face it though, I'm never gonna get tired of any of these because they're so good. Uh, but I will have a picture for you at the end. You're gonna be. I'm gonna try to get looking down into the jar, and we'll get it as good as we can get it and thanks for watching